And now, presenting the field for the 38th American Beauty. Number one is Scratched. Number two is WSS Racing's She's So Majestic. John Alexander Ortiz is the trainer, and the jockey is Ramon Vasquez. Number three is Three Chimneys Farms' Magic Dance. Steve Asmussen is the trainer, and the jockey is Ricardo Santana, Jr. Number four is Scratched. Number five is Wild Woods Beauty. Owned by William Stiritz and trained by Scott Becker, the jockey, Joseph Rocco, Jr. Number six is the Novogratz Racing Stables Incorporated's Amy's Challenge. Mac Robertson is the trainer, and the jockey is Francisco Arrieta. Number seven is the Frank Fletcher Racing Operations Incorporated's Frank's Rocket. Billy Mott is the trainer, and the jockey is Florent Giroux. And completing the field, number eight, Tracy Harsman's Best Kept Secret. Robert Klein is the trainer, and the jockey is Kelsey Har. Number nine is scratched, and that's the field for the 38th running of the American Beauty. They're off. Very even start. Amy's Challenge and Frank's Rockhead now sprint out from Magic Dance and She's So Majestic. Next, it's Wildwood's Beauty and the trailer is Best Kept Secret. Amy's Challenge up the backstretch now has the lead by just over a length from Frank's Rockhead in second. She's So Majestic is at the rail third, and she's about a length and a half from the front running Amy's Challenge. Then comes Best Kept Secret and Magic Dance, and Wildwood's Beauty would have to pass them all to win the 38th American Beauty. They leave the backstretch. Amy's Challenge continues to lead. She's a tight length in front of Frank's Rockhead, who's now pushed along just a bit by Florent Giroux. Amy's Challenge traveling well at the quarter pull. Best kept secret to the outside races in third. Three lengths further back to She's So Majestic and Wildwood's Beauty and here's Frank's Rockette to come calling outside of Amy's Challenge. Frank's Rockette outside. Amy's Challenge inside and Frank's Rockette has taken a clear lead. She's now a length in front of Amy's Challenge in second. Then Wildwood's Beauty but it's Frank's Rockette clear now. Amy's Challenge second. Wildwood's Beauty third. Frank's Rockette in front. The 38th American Beauty went to Frank's Rockhead over Amy's Challenge. Wildwood's Beauty was third, close for fourth, best kept secret, and she's so majestic. And now returning to the winner's circle, the winner of the 38th running of the American Beauty, Frank's Rockhead and jockey Florent Giroux. Frank's Rockhead is owned by F Frank Fletcher Racing Operations Incorporated. Hall of Famer Billy Mott is the trainer. Running time, one minute. 10 seconds flat. A very impressive victory in today's American Beauty. Frank's Rocket, a homebred for owner Frank Fletcher Racing Operations. Hall of Famer Bill Mott sends this one out. He won this running back in 1986. And I know this win is even more special to you because you bred her. How special is it to win this in your own backyard? Well, she had a wonderful season as a three-year-old. And you never know what's going to happen when you are off three or four months. But she's been down in Miami kind of resting. And uh, this is her first start back for the season for a four-year-old. She really had some great competition with a six-horse today. And uh, I was, quite frankly, really nervous. But she turned it on as she normally does. <laughs> well, let's talk about that, Frank. She sat off some very quick fractions, set by a very nice filly or mayor in Amy's Challenge, but a great ride by Florent Giroux and kind of put it into the next gear coming into the top of the stretch. Well, it's hard for me to hear you. Oh, uh, sorry. <laughs> but uh, 
I just thought I thought she ran a great race today and uh, was was really proud of her when she's coming down the stretch. I looked at the time and it's 110, so I don't know, that's pretty fast for a muddy track. So we were pleased with the speed she was going. Well, I know that Bill Mott has said that he doesn't have any long-term plans for her, but I know that if there's a race in your backyard, he's more likely to lean to Oaklawn. Well, we're, you know, this is my home track, so uh, I couldn't be prouder than I am today. <laughs> Got all my friends here, so thank you very much. Congratulations, Frank's Rocket, victorious in the American Beauty.